also had experience of, you know, builders and they will come. I've done stuff like that. I've done the builders and they will come thing and they didn't come. Yeah. You're absolutely right, Jeff. I've, I've invested, you know, time, effort and money in doing something that I thought, well, okay, this kind of philosophy of builders and it'll happen. Yeah. And, I, and I did it to see, but I, I wasn't relying on it because I've always had a few different projects going or I've had my finger in a number of different pies. I've never relied on one thing. And when you're setting up your your uh, your own practice i would say to any individual that think about it you've come out of whatever it is some body work therapy school whatever the stripe is you have whether it's acupuncture or whatever i would really encourage people as much as possible not to go out on their own initially now that doesn't mean you can't go out on your own yeah go out on your own if that's the if that's what you really the, want yeah the tidal wave that's pushing you but I would say that um, if there's a business acumen needed, you've got to earn your stripes again. So I'd be saying, see if you can find a clinic that you can work within, whether that's a multidisciplinary clinic yeah. or that you're working under the auspices of somebody who's you know, experienced and more qualified than you. And you begin to learn the ropes. You begin to see the pitfalls. You begin to see what works, what doesn't work. Yeah. But at the same time, you don't have all the responsibility of having invested you know, some huge amount of money building an extension to your house and suddenly your business goes wrong. You don't just lose your business, you lose the house, you lose yeah. everything. Yeah. So be ready to to um, start off with small, with small steps. Oh. But the ideal scenario for me would be start off slowly and, you know, learn to... It's, the, it's all the old cliches. There's nothing new here. <laughs> learn to walk before you run. Yeah. You know, and uh, and be appreciative of getting that experience, yeah. so that you can take a deep breath, and you can really make informed choices yeah. uh, about the type of uh, clinic that you're going to that you're going to offer. And of course, it's again, it comes down to um, things like location, location, yeah. location. You know, yeah. gives you that opportunity. Now, if you're